Welcome back. Today we're replacing the windshield wiper blade on the rear of a 2016 Highlander. But I'll list all the other models that this works for because it works for several different models. The first thing that you'll notice here is that you can't get the windshield wiper blade away from the window to get room to replace it. Now today we're going to replace just the rubber insert. But this could work also to replace the whole arm if that's what you wish to do. I loosened this up just a little bit before, but this part right here will spread out a little bit just by putting your fingernail under it and then take that off. And once that's off, that'll give you plenty of room to be able to pick this up and then get it out like this. And now once it's out like this, you'll have more room to work on it. At this point, we could work on just the insert, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually take it all the way off. So to do that, all you do is you take this and now it'll flip all the way back and once that happens it'll give you room to then take it off all right now let's lay it down and we'll work on replacing the rubber insert so now you'll notice that the windshield wiper you can then bend it and you can get it past this plastic tab you see this metal piece right here we're going to want to keep it so when you take it out you don't want to bend this too much but you'll be able to take that metal piece off and put it on your new windshield wiper blade now i picked this up as an oem toyota part and you can get this at your dealer for less than ten dollars i paid probably eleven dollars on amazon but there's you a couple of different sources so you can keep your oem arm as you'll see i just slid that right out past that plastic tab there because it had enough flex to it once you get that out, you'll see that this stainless steel metal piece will lift right out of that old blade. And then you can put it right into the gap of the new blade. We're going to do that now. And once you've done one side, I took it out of this, and I simply put it into that gap. Once you've done one side, then you do the other side. And this comes out just very easily now. It literally falls out. We're going to put it in the gap of the other side. I need two hands, so I'll be right back once it's done. But you literally just lay it in the gap. Okay, now that we've got our metal strips back into the blade, we're going to push it right, right back into that groove, and then into that groove, and then into this one. And again, I need two hands for this, so I'm not going to show this, but it's very easy. It's flexible enough to do this. Start at this end and work it through. I'm going to stop and show you a close-up. And it goes right back into that groove right there. And then you push it all the way up to the end. Okay, even though I stopped that to do it with two hands, it took me literally about 10 seconds. So now we're ready to put this right back on the car in the reverse order that we did this in. Okay, I've got this back engaged. And you want to fold it flat like that. So that took a little bit just to get it in, but work at it. And you, let me get a close up of this so you see exactly how it goes. You fold that back down. And you put this back in place. And we're done replacing the windshield wiper blade on the 2016. It's also the same as I believe a 2014 all the way through at least 19, probably 21 and 22, 23. Like, share and subscribe.